Hi everyone, uh, welcome to our opening and stretching of the chest and the shoulders. Uh, so this video we're gonna focus on really just bringing the chest and the shoulders open uh, so we can experience kind of the shoulders and the chest caving in from a lot of just daily life activities. Uh, for example, driving, uh, typing, texting with our head down or kind of shoulders coming in. Um, sometimes we sleep on our sides that can also bring the shoulders and the chest inward. So in this sequence, we're really gonna work on just kind of of opening that back up. Uh, I have with me my blanket here, so if you want to grab a blanket or a towel just for extra comfort under the bunk, uh, you can go ahead and do that now. And we are going to get started uh, seated on the mat. Okay, so if you have your towel or blanket, just kind of roll it um, about this high, so we have a little bit of height to it. Go ahead and take a seat on the blanket until you feel comfortable. Legs are going to stay crossed in front of us, so just gently cross whatever feels good to you. So a loose cross, maybe you bring the legs in a little bit tighter, just find your comfort level. And go ahead and bring the arms behind you and interlace the fingertips, pressing the palms together. Begin to straighten the arms down, pulling the knuckles down to the earth, and then gently beginning to lift the heart up towards the sky. We already feel that opening in the heart. And then just continue to draw the shoulders down and back the spine. Just begin to breathe in and out through the nose. And we'll take five full breaths here. Gently begin to slide. 
like the right palm back towards the face, pressing into the right palm. Inhale, left fingertips high. And exhale, tabletop. All right, moving into our puppy pose. We're gonna begin to walk the palms out forward until the forehead rests gently onto the mat. Yes, so stretching the arms. The hips stay stacked right over the knees. And then begin to press the palms into the earth. So you're deepening the stretch in the shoulders. You can feel it in the back here. Moving the heart towards the earth. Five full breaths. just to feel the rounding in the spine here. Counterbalance that cobra. And shift back forward to a tabletop. And again, come to lying down on the mat. And this time we are going to bring the arms behind us, interlace the fingertips for a locust with chest expansion. Untuck the toes, press the tops of the feet into the earth. And on your inhale, begin to lift the heart and pull the knuckles back. So we're drawing the shoulders back to open the shoulders, open the chest. Now neck is long, so reach the crown of the head forward, pressing the feet into the earth. Three more full breaths here. Yeah, tuck the forehead to the kneecaps, stretch 
stretching out the arms. Posture here. It's floor bow. Let's come back down to the mat, onto the bellies. Bend both knees back. And reach the arms behind you. Capture the outsides of the feet. And bring the knees in. And on your inhale, begin to kick into the palms, kicking the toes up and back. Yeah, lifting the heart, drawing the shoulders back. Pointing the toes to the sky. Bring the knees in. Five full breaths here. So hopefully your chest and your shoulders are feeling a little bit more open after that. Uh, if you want to take it deeper, I recommend holding each posture for one minute. All right, bye everyone.